Hey folks, Mark here. Thought I'd run through the plan mode in ASI Air Plus just to give you guys an indication of what it looks like. Right now I'm on an iPad and I'm loading up the program as you can see. I've checked my connection. My connection is good and I'm about to enter the program. Once I enter the program, I'm going to choose from the upper right hand corner the plan mode from the preview screen and the plan mode pops up. Once I'm in the plan mode, I can look in the upper right hand corner there and open up a new project. The first thing is to name it. So I'm going to type in test one for the project name. And then I'm going to go through the various different options and you can look through the options there. One of the most important ones is to turn on the cooling of the camera if you have a cooled camera. And then further down you can see where I'm setting up the start and finish times on the unit. So I'm going to start this project in one minute from now and then just end it when the plan ends. After I've done this, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to choose the targets I want to see. So, right now, you can see I'm still fiddling with the options that are available. And now I go and exit the plan mode. And what you'll find out is I failed to confirm the plan so it won't pop up. At this point, I have to go back choose the plan mode again, retype in the name, test one, and then once I do this and make my selections, I'll go ahead and hit confirm, which you can see up there at the top next to the cancel button. Once I've confirmed it, now I can add targets and I hit the plus sign on the screen and a list of targets pops up so tonight for instance I'm going to choose M101 so to pull up M101 or at least I thought it would right now it has the last target I picked out because I didn't choose M101 so what I'll do here is create a new sequence and hit the plus sign gives me an opportunity to apply the sequence and settings and there's M101. So now I've got two targets set up for my viewing and I'm looking again at another target. We chose NGC 70 or NGC 4206. So there it is. That's my third target. My first target, as you can see, is too low on the horizon. So I'm going to delete that target. I'm going to hit the detail button, pull that target up and say, do I want to delete it? Yes, I do want to delete it. And boom, it's gone. Now I have two high flying targets, as you can see by the red line, and I'm ready to begin my plan. Once again, I want to look at my cooling in my plan, turn it on, make sure that's there, go to auto tool cooling, and then once again after I get that set up, I think I'm going to go back to my main camera, check all the features there, and once again check my overall settings. This is an import plan we can do. If you want to import a plan from your computer, you can do that. I'm not doing that. But here we go. We're ready to do that and save it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and got to see at least a little bit of what the program does. The plan mode is a pretty neat application for the ASI Air Plus 
and I think it'll make a lot of folks very happy once they learn how to use it. That's all for now, folks. Enjoy your evenings and clear skies.